Angela's here with an update for weather as she prepares us, she prepares <laughs> to prepare us for the weather change that is about to come over the next 24 hours. Yeah, we yeah. need you to be weather aware on two fronts, rain and colder temps, right? You're going to need the umbrella, you're going to need the heavier coat, and right now Thanksgiving is looking chilly, so mm. that is on the seven day. We are a week away and we'll get there in just a second. Uh, when is the rain getting here? Not until after midnight, so live Doppler 13 radar is clear right now. We're just now starting to see a few showers developing out to our west across parts of Iowa, back through Kansas and Nebraska, into Missouri. These are developing ahead and along a cold front that will bring some dramatic changes to our weather pattern. Kind of a dramatic sky right now. Clouds are moving in. We have still a little bit of sunshine overhead and temperatures in the 60s. Very mild today, 63 degrees currently. Winds are out of the south southwest at nine miles per hour made it to 67 degrees this afternoon. Close, but not quite record high 74 set back in 1931. Our low this morning 39. We're actually gonna be closer to 50 early tomorrow morning. Sunset this evening happens at 529 and no rain today, but we do have some much needed rain on the way for tomorrow. How much are we expecting anywhere from a 10th to maybe on the high side, a quarter to a third of an inch of rain. This is rainfall potential with future track 13. I'll get to the timeline in just a second. Be prepared for the rain tomorrow off and on, but the steadiest will fall before noon with just a few spotty showers expected tomorrow afternoon and temperatures that will start to take a tumble by late afternoon, early evening. As promised, this is future track 13. We're going to start it at 11 o'clock tonight. When you join us at 11, cloudy skies still dry. The rain will be just across the state line, starts to fill in overnight. So after midnight, when Chuck is on, sunrise begins at 4 o'clock tomorrow morning. He will be tracking some rain. This is future track 13 and the rain at times will be steady or heavy at least through the morning drive. This is 8 o'clock tomorrow morning. Heavy rain potential from Indianapolis East and then it shifts off to the east with just a few showers left by midday. We start to clear things out and cool things down by late afternoon, early evening. By this time tomorrow we are dry, but turning colder and temperatures tomorrow evening will fall fast through the 40s into the 30s all the way down into the 20s by first thing Saturday morning. As cold as 23 Muncie, 24 Lafayette and Kokomo will forecast a low of 28 in Indianapolis. That's how we start the weekend Saturday afternoon. At least there's some sunshine. We're going to need it because it's going to be a much cooler day with highs in the upper 40s, close to 50 degrees on Sunday afternoon, just a bit warmer back into the mid 50s. But this is a brief warm up. We're at 55 on Sunday, 51 on Monday. 50 on Tuesday. A stronger weather system arrives late Monday into Tuesday, bringing us rain and wind. Good thing to keep in mind if you're traveling ahead of the holiday early in the week. But right now, locally, that busy travel day Wednesday looks fine, just cold. Thanksgiving mm. Day looks fine, just cold, 35. <laughs> All right, so we're excited about Friday, Felicia. So we're going to need that rain gear in the morning. Yes. And then a heavier coat particularly in the afternoon and evening for Operation Football. Oh, yes, yeah, semi-state tomorrow. Yeah, I'm bringing out my Chicago coat. I'm not playing <laughs> any games. I am not playing Felicia with you people. Felicia is going to be ready on Friday. <laughs> yes, I will be.